they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. Oh my god. Diego. Back to Diego. Mbappe. Dembele got his foot in to cut out the pass. Striding forward purposefully. Let's go, Maradona. 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 Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome uh, to another video on the channel. Now, Footman's SBCs are over. By the way, we're testing out different camera mounts. I've just redone a ton of the setup, so just kind of moving things around still. So if you see me at one angle one day and another angle the other, it's just because I'm moving stuff around. I'm still trying to find the perfect height. No longer am I duct taped. My camera, we actually have a nice mount now, adjustable and everything. I can hire it. I can lower it. So I'm kind of working with some settings on it. I'm trying to figure it out. Anyways, guys, we do not have footless any longer, uh, sadly, for the player SBC. So those will die down. However, we've got a really special review today. We're trying out some of the newer Prime Icons. Um, and today, we're going to be trying out uh, Diego Maradona, his 97-rated version. Now, this is a version that was like 10 million coins the other day. So it's now down a lot in value. So I said, you know what? Let's try him out. Let's see how he is. Is he solid? We got him on a semi-deal uh, for today, for the most part, he's been about 5.8 million for most of the day, six to seven mil. He was 11 mil the other day. He's actually 12 mil on Xbox right now. So this price at 4.8 is pretty cheap compared to what he has been. But on the market, he's getting panic sold. People are not buying Prime icons at the moment. So obviously, he's getting a little bit more affordable on the market. But I wanted to test him out, man. This is probably in this year's game, in my opinion, one of the best cards available in this game because the dribbling. There is such an emphasis on dribbling and the pretty type of play this year that I can't really see this card being a bad a bad choice this year. So, 97 rated Maradona. The traits that you have on this card is finesse shot trait, flare trait. So, you've got some traits to go there. Uh, good looks there. He's got a three-star weak foot, which is kind of the downside with the card. That's probably one of the only things that's actually wrong with this card. I used this baby card this year, and I loved it a lot. Um, he's got a five-star skill combination. He's got 92 pace, 93 shooting, 92 passing, 97 dribbling, and he's also got 70, uh, 76 physical. If you look a little bit into the card, uh, besides that, he's got 94 acceleration, 90 sprint speed, 97 finishing, uh, 92 attack positioning, 85 shot power, 94 long shots, 88 volleys, 94 penalties. It, all the stats on this card are just mental, man. If you look at all of them, it's, it's hard to actually know what kind of chemistry style uh, to even put on this dude because everything is just phenomenal he's got 95 vision 88 crossing 96 free kick accuracy 93 short passing 89 long passing 96 curve 95 composure 98 balance 91 agility 94 reactions 97 ball control 98 dribbling the number one thing that i have noticed on this card when playing with this baby his dribbling is the best that i've used out of any card in this game i, I think i think it's the best dribbling that i've used out of any any player he's got 82 jumping 78 stamina 75 strength and 76 aggression so chemistry style wise in my opinion, you don't really have to touch the finishing because the finishing is already at 97. I think we I think we bought him fresh with an engine, which actually doesn't look like a terrible chemistry style to give him. I don't really know if you need to give him strength. I feel like you probably want to just kind of max out everything you can passing, dribbling, and pace-wise. Pace is close to max out. He's got 99 acceleration. So for the sake of the video, I think we're going to keep the engine on him because I think for me, when I played with the baby, I played him on a basic. So you could also do that if you really wanted to. Uh, for me, I think we'll just keep... We'll keep the engine on because I feel like that works. Um, now, it is a Thursday. No, it's a Wednesday. I'm a little bit off in terms of my my days of the week right now. Uh, it is a Wednesday. Um, so we're going to hop into Division Rivals, guys. That's what we're going to try them out. I think formation-wise, what I want to do today, we'll definitely, I think, do a... Should we do a 4 2 3 one or a 4 one 2 into Nero? I mean, what kind of players do we have to work with? We've got Benzema, we've got Tissoko, and we've got Vidal and Mbappe. For me, I'm going to actually try them out, I think, in a 4 one 2 into Nero. Um, and the reason why we'll do this, I think we're either going to sub Benzema off or we'll keep him, uh, at center mid, you know, for me guys with these reviews, I don't really care too much. Um, you know, I, I don't really mind. We'll do Messi. Uh, we'll do Messi, Maradona. Yeah, we'll do Messi, Maradona, Mbappe, and then we'll do Benzema and Sissoko as the center mids. We'll do Vidal as the DM cause he's a little bit slower. We'll do get him behind. We'll do stay forward for Maradona. And then the, the CDM is going to have cut passing lanes. I also just need to confirm real quick which attacking uh you know which formation that that's going to be with just so i know exactly what we're doing so it's the attacking style no it's the it's the defensive style formation rather and so maradona cam messi and mbappe up top this should be a really fun team to play with like i would be shocked 
Now, the only the only warning that I have for you guys is I'm not feeling the best. Like my head is like not it's not in like a totally proper condition to probably be playing tons of FIFA, but we'll play a few games, we'll try them out. Hopefully, I'm not terrible. I haven't played FIFA since the Renata review, which has been like two full days. So We'll kind of see how he is. We tried out Nedved. I loved Nedved. I thought he was really good. So if you guys want other Prime Icon reviews, man, just let me know in the comments down below. And uh, I will let you guys know when we have uh, found our first opponent. All right, guys. Our first upcoming opponent has a really good team. Uh, in my opinion, he probably did a bunch of base icon packs because he has that Larson. He's got Zola. And he's also got Sadarf. He's got PK and Varane, Ter Stegen, Semedo, Mendy, Neymar, and Dembele. Let's take care of it. We've got here perfectly suited to football and to... Very noisy sets of fans. What a backdrop that should be to what on paper should be a, an edge. Let's oh Diego man, what was that touch there? Let's go, Diego. Ooh, and this is something that I actually really liked with this card when I originally had it, is he's got this like weird strength on him, man. Like I swear. I don't know how he still has the ball, but he's got the ball. Now we've got the ball with Messi. Oh my god, and he draws the penalty. So we do the scoop turn into the drag back, and PK just falls over. We are playing at like 1,800 skill rating now, guys. So the skill rating is super, uh, in my opinion, it's competitive. That was a little bit lucky. We probably shouldn't have scored that. But it is. these games are going to be tough. I'm not going to be probably scoring a lot of goals unless I'm playing insane. So we go up 1-0 thanks to Diego. Nice play from Diego. It's a weak foot pass as well. Diego Maradona. Oh, if I slid, oh, if I slid that pass through, that would have been crazy. Mendy. Can't keep the ball at the moment. <laughs> nice play. Can Messi finish it? Oh, Ter Stegen. Yo, Ter Stegen is so broken in this game. Decided that this time they're going to play the short corner. Oh my gosh, bros. You guys don't even understand how good this dribbling is. Look, like, look. Ah, it's so, dude, it, it make, this card makes you feel like you have a card that just responds to your commands, which in FIFA is a very big rarity. So, we are up 1-0 at halftime. Let's see how much damage we can do in the second half. Obviously, I want to score more goals, but at this skill rating, it is really hard to score a ton. So, I'm trying. Pass it. Let's go. Maradona. Oh, the pass was so underwhelming, man. What a pass from Diego, man. He stays on side. Oh, we were totally going to score there. I couldn't stay on side. Oh, the touch at the end. What was that from Diego, man? What was that touch, dude? Oh, that touch was so bad. Back post. Maradona with the finish. And it makes it 2-0, boys. We win 2-0, game number one. Let's get it, man. So, okay, first game with Diego. Some questionable touches, but overall, I like the, I like the effort of game one. Let's go. All right, boys, our second opponent, um, I did record, I did just record, rather, um, another game, but uh, the connection was really laggy and all that. He was very good. We lost 2-1. We had a last-minute assist with Diego Maradona. It doesn't matter, though. The gameplay was really, really, like, not that, I don't know, it wasn't that nice, so I don't think you guys would have enjoyed it to watch it. It would have been a little bit laggy and delayed, um, but we're, gonna, we're going into game number two that you guys will see, and technically... Uh, game number three for me with Maradona. So let's go. Just getting across, he thought quickly as well. And this is the lineup for the home side. Nice pass there. We're gonna we're gonna run the line here with Sissoko. Oh yeah. What a play! Let's go. Is that a goal? Oh, it's offside, man. We get a uh, really big recovery there. Come on, Diego. Scoop turn that. Let's go. Goal. Let's go, man. So the thing that I had noticed with baby Maradona, if you get him in the situation at the top of the box, because of his dribbling and his quick agility and like, he's got the strength combination with the height, with being small, 
if you utilize the scoop turn, man, like that right there is something that I just I find so overpowered with him. They can be quick on the break now. Ronaldinho. What a play. Oh no. Oh, <laughs> that was nasty. Fair play, man. As I said, guys, up at this skill rating, we're starting to play a lot of good players. So the games are a lot more tight. Um, a lot Usually there's more, you know, there's less scoring. It seems like this game might not be the deadest game in terms of scoring. Um, he's playing an attacking play style, and so am I, which makes it, uh, I think, makes it for some good fun. Benzema. Suzuka. Opening them up with a through pass. Play to Mendy. Messi. On to Mbappe. Oh, yeah. Messi. Messi. Oh, yeah. Oh, the post. Finish it, Benz. Oh, my God. That was good. And the tackler has been very successful there. He's got possession. Run, Messi. Run. Run, Messi. Run. Go, Messi. Go. Go, Messi. What a pass from Diego. Mbappe, oh, what a play, man. Let's go. Mbappe, right before the 45th minute, before you guys say that I'm getting momentum, on the weak foot, past Ter Stegen. I think that's an assist for Maradona. Oh, my God, that first touch. Oh, I should have shot in your post, but that first touch, man, that's the ball control. All those dribbling stats that we have maxed out on him, that was an insane first touch. I don't know what defender that was around. I think it was around PK, but... My God, that was insane. So we go up halftime with an advantage. Probably there, if I had taken the right touch, we could be up 3-1, but it is what it is. We may switch up the formation in the second half. Well, they're getting the ball forward. They need to do that. Oh, my God. Diego. Back to Diego. Oh, my Lordy. Let's go. Maradona to Messi. Back to Diego. These guys together are insane, man. I'm telling you, like, I'm having so much fun playing with these guys. And that's important because that was a weak foot finish. I wanted to test it out. I didn't want to just do the ball roll back onto the strong foot. I wanted to try out uh, the weak foot with Diego. So, very nice, Mbappe. Let's go, Maradona. Maradona. Oh, oh my God. Oh my lord! That was crazy, man. That was such a rocket, dude. He's just, he's nuts in this game, I'm telling you guys. Like, the, the way this dude dribbles and passes, it's, uh, it's insane, man. Look at that tight dribbling, man. Right as the DM is coming, he just does the quick little ball roll and just escapes any situation there. I love that. Nice play from Benz. We get inside positioning here. This is crazy at the moment. Oh my! Go! What a pass! Diego! No, he missed it. Is that a foul though? Oh, he got killed. I was about to say that has to be a foul. Diego to Messi. Let's put this pen away and let's put this game away, guys. Let's go, man. Five to three. We scored two penalties in this video, too. That should be the game. Uh, should be. Unless I choke this hard. I was about to say, dude. But, again, you guys saw a breakaway speed there. It was huge. All right, guys. That is going to be the review for Maradona. I, I don't have much to say. Um, I think if you have this card in your team, you have to use him as a cam or even a striker. I mean, I did use him as a lone striker for a part of the second game, and he was sick. Um fantastic card worth every penny and i think for you guys baby middle or prime works because this card the thing that i noticed against his baby with this card everything that was already feeling good just felt even better um but the difference between the two wasn't that big right the baby was still pretty close to what this is um absolutely insane card for this year's meta in my opinion this will be once some people start to use this card, regardless of the weak foot, they won't be able to move away from it. I saw Kurt use this card the other weekend. He is unbelievable, this specific Prime version. So, you know, 4.8 million coins is a lot, but I'm, I'm in love with this card. I just used him, and I think he's so good. Um, I think if you play him with other players, with 5-star skills, with other nimble players as well, 
it, it just makes for an insane combination. Something that I loved about the card was the passing, man. Every pass this guy is making feels like it's on the money and just feels like you're able to make those nice little one-twos everywhere. Finishing felt good. We scored two penalties with him. He had a top corner banger. Um, so in my opinion, absolutely mental card this year. Um, so just let me know what other primes you guys want me to try out because there are a lot of other primes. You guys want me to try another one? Just let me know. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys soon. Peace. Peace.